Hey Geeks, Tim Tibbetts with MajorGeeks.com and today's little quick tip is how to add multiple time zones to your clock. In this case we're using Windows 10 but you can find it in Windows 7 or 8. You're going to want to go to either your control panel and find your time, date and time settings or I like the Windows key plus S if you watch any of our videos I love to do that. And I can start typing in date or start typing in time either or and look for date and time settings. When you do you can scroll on down and you will find add clocks for different time zones. Windows 7 and 8 users will see additional clock tab. Click on that. So as you can see, you line your mouse over. There's today's date, time. So let's start with, I was playing earlier, so I have a couple of these already set. You click, once you click on show this clock, hit the drop down button, and it looks just like it did when you installed Windows initially, if you've done that, exactly the same. So in this case, I have Santiago, so I named it Santiago. Otherwise, default will be clock one, clock two. Click apply. There is Santiago. And of course, when it's minimized by lining your mouse over, you will see it here. Neat. So just for kicks, you got the point, but we'll show another clock. So now you can have three. In this case, we're using Cairo for fun. We named it Cairo. We click apply. And we come over here, and there are your three time zones. Click on your clock, and there it is. So, again, it's just one of those neat little quick tips you might not have known about because I embarrassingly can admit that, um, yeah, I didn't know about this until the other day. So, um, yeah, tens of thousands of tips and tweaks and tricks you can do in Windows, and somehow I missed this one over the last 25 years. There you go. So now you can have up to three clocks. You can keep track of different time zones on your Windows machine. As always, thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.